Babe, look at Bronx's setup now. Oh, now I can find him. Yeah. Oh my God, this is so much better. Where is he? You see his tail right there. Oh, Over yeah. Over the top. Hi, buddy. I already feel. So I'm, I'm glad you didn't have COVID yesterday. I was worried you were so sick. I didn't feel well, and you were like, oh, could it be morning sickness? I'm like, no, it's not even possible at this point. How are you feeling about this cycle? We got it done, or you think? <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. It's, I don't have the feeling in my soul that it... That it happened. But I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. If it doesn't work out this time, we got next month. Exactly. We need to practice. Practice more, a, lot. a lot. A lot more, yeah. <laughs> That's why I ordered those prenatals. Did you, that... did you take them today? No, they just came in. I had a couple. Maybe, yeah. Maybe it'll help me. You ate prenatals? We're not supposed to? Is it like estrogen? Seeing a negative pregnancy test sucks because I'm hoping, I'm praying, I'm wishing for the best. And then in the back of my mind, I'm also thinking, is this gonna be a forever negative pregnancy test? Can they give I'll me acupuncture really to have like, you know, super swimmers Maybe. put some Michael Phelps in my scrotum? A... We did the thing and then he did the thing, now give me the thing. And it's like, womp, womp, womp. So, you know, we talk about the premarital counseling yeah. stuff. I haven't gotten it from Danny yet, but I'd like to set an appointment and meet his Like with his their, guy, the ones with that their they person. use? Yeah, yeah. Danny made a good point about, you know, a premarital counselor. I would love to do that with you. I do think it's important, and I think it's, we both have said, there's a lot we don't know enough about to have intelligent conversations about with the child that comes into it. Okay. Another thing I want is just, I want, how can we figure out how I can have a little bit more of my life here? Oh. I'm a good floor sipper. I need to be grounded. You know how I get some LA fatigue out here, just being in the city and how I'm used to open spaces. I want to fish. I don't have close friends here. I'm making friends, but yeah. it's not the same. What, uh, what were you saying? I'm sorry. I don't have my tools, my right. fishing stuff. Right. I can't go shoot my bow. Um. Yeah, I want to have a space that feels like my space. And for some reason. Do you have reservations? Uh. I still feel like I am in your apartment. There's 95% your stuff here. Yeah. But I mean, if we, when we bring a child into this world, I don't want to have that same kind of feeling. Do you not like my decoration? No, I'm not saying I dislike anything. I'm saying it doesn't feel like our place as much as your place. No, for sure. Well, next time we go to Colorado together, I want to go through a lot of my stuff. The last time we were in Colorado, it was like 99 degrees oh, out and we would have died. Hence why I don't ever want to live in Colorado. <laughs> I love Colorado. I love the ranch, but I'm not living there full time. They have to bring in their water. Luke just got electricity put in. I can't post me to damn thing. I rest my case. It's honestly weird for me to live anywhere I don't have a fishing pool. It is my happy place. I don't think about anything but trying to catch fish. Yeah, I'm not necessarily going to go fishing with you like I did once, but like I love a good boat trip. And I'll, I'll be like, yeah, let me take a picture. Hold your fish up. <laughs>
I'd rather you not tell me because I slip. But she did mention in the girls' night that the whole, like, the sexual thing was, like, off. God, what else did she tell you? She just wants, like, to get that spark back. She wants to, yeah. like, you know, to you to know be she's more, really like, in tune to what's going on. Men are stupid. Let's keep it real. Men can be oblivious. They don't see the sign. They don't know what's going on half the time. So I think, you know, meeting with Jax today, he can hear it from somebody who is listening to Britney as a friend and can be like, hey, bro, your wife is going through X, Y, and Z. It's like, we get it, Jax. You love Britney. We all know actions speak louder than words, and you need to start doing that. All we used time. to be all over. No, Brittany said she was a freak. She we told were like she rabbits. Like, I was a freak. <laughs> we were, we were freaks. And then the baby came, and then yeah. you guys are always home with the baby. Like use that, like. But I was using it to say, let's go out and get drunk, and let's like, yeah. let's go oh, in the bathroom. Like how we used to be. <laughs> Honestly, I think with her too, it's more. I think she wants like that, like compliments throughout the day. You're right. Like, send something dirty to her. Send a text. Her her love language is my mouth between her legs. That's, <laughs> Well, then there we go. <laughs> Say that. I'd be like, hey, I'm, I can't wait to come home and put my face between your legs. Whatever it is. Okay. Like, get some, like, little mind. toys or something. Fun. Yeah, well, I don't she's know. got plenty of those. She's probably stuff. been using the shit out of them since I've been around. I haven't been Stop. around. Did the amount of batteries do? we go through I mean, is insane. <laughs> You're don't right. be so hard on yourself. No, I'm not. I'm not. I, I, I know. I'm not. I'm just, I'm trying. I really am trying. I really think it just doesn't want to end up like, like Jesse and Michelle. That will never, that. ever, ever but happen. That is, but see how, like, basic little things can lead to that, you know? Do you think it's Jesse's fault or Michelle's fault, or do you think they both have something to do with it? No clue. Do you think she's just over him? What he told me at the, we went to the right. carnival, he goes, if my marriage lasts the next two months, I'll be shocked. Wow, I didn't know it was like so, that. I knew they were going through tough times. How's everything going? Is like uh, the therapy, how's that going? Yeah, Is yeah. it good? Yeah. Right now it's bad. As we were leaving the fair, Jesse kind of brought it up that he thought his marriage would be over in the next couple months.